Next, we're going to try to transform this while loop example into a do while loop example. First of all, I would like to save this example as a do while loop example. So I'm going to change the class name to meet the to match the file name. Now, these are some of the things that you would have to keep in mind for a do while loop since it's a post condition loop. So the condition, the ending condition, need to be moved to the end of the loop block and then you add a semicolon. Then instead of where the while was, you simply add the word do. You still have the starting point, you still have the ending point, you ha still have a way to get from start to an end. The only difference is you have moved your condition, which was a precondition, into a post condition. Now I've already talked about the details of pre and a post condition a few tutorials ago when I introduced the loop so I'm not going over those details again in this tutorial. So all we are doing is we all have a starting point, we have an ending condition and we have a way to get to the ending condition. So as I run my loop it runs exactly the same way printing all the numbers from 1 through 10. Now I can do the same here if I want to print all the odd numbers from 1 through 10, I simply change my increments to 2 and as I rerun this program you're going to see it prints odd numbers. If I want to print even numbers from 1 through 10 then all I need to do is change my starting point to 2 instead of 1 because even number, the first even number is 2 and if I rerun the program you're going to print all the even numbers. If I want to display all the even numbers from 1 through 20, all I need to do is change my ending condition to 20, and now it displays all the even numbers running from 2 through 20. So the idea is exactly the same. You could write your logic in a while loop, you could write your logic in a new while loop. Hope you would have enjoyed this tutorial, and of course, you can do the same here. You can increment it by 2. These two approaches don't count. Catch you in another tutorial. Have a good one.